Legend has it that for centuries, Mel Kiefer was a closely guarded secret of the Northern Caucasus region in Russia. The people of the Northern Caucasus region are renowned for their longevity with one of the highest proportions of centenarians in the world. Mel Kiefer has been a dietary staple in this region for hundreds, maybe even thousands of years. So how does such a harsh secret reach our humble Maziwa Dawa enterprises, you ask? Well, that's a story wrote in with adventure, thrill, and peril. It probably started back in the 1900s when Russian immunologist Dr. Ilya Ilyich Machinkov who received the Nobel Peace Prize for his work on immunity in 1908, became interested in learning about the causes of the exceptional longevity of the people in the Caucasus region and other regions. Machinkov came to the conclusion that Mel Kiefer was one of the keys to longevity and well-being. Following the publication of Machinkov's book, The Prolongation of Life in 1907, the old Russian Physician Society became determined to use milk kefir as a medicinal treatment for their patients. The blend of brothers from Moscow diary were commissioned by the all Russian Physicians Society to obtain kefir grains from the tribes in the Caucasus Mountains. However, the tribes refused to sell any kefir grains to the blend of brothers. Undaunted, the brothers came up with a scheme to obtain the kefir grains. They would send a beautiful woman to the court of tribal prince Bek Marza Bacharov, and with her allure, she would obtain the kefir grains. Irina Sakharova, an employee of the Land of Brothers, was chosen for this important mission. Although Irina succeeded in attracting the interest of Prince Bacharov, he refused to give her any kefir grains. Irina departed from the prince, but tribesmen were sent to capture her with the intention of forcing her to marry the prince. The blend of brothers mounted a rescue of Irina before the forced marriage could take place. When Irina presented her grievance before the Tsar, Prince Bacharov was ordered to make retribution to Irina. Although she was offered gold and jewels, Irina refused. She could only be compensated for what she had endured in one way, with kefir grains. The Tsar ordered Prince Bacharov to give Irina 10 pounds of kefir grain. Once the blend of brothers had the milk kefir grain, they began making kefir for all the Russian physician society. Kefir was used in Russian hospitals to treat a wide variety of conditions, including digestive disorders, cancer, and tuberculosis. Even now, kefir is routinely used for hospital patients, infants, and infirm people in Eastern Europe. Milk kefir was introduced to the Western world by the 1960s. Recently, milk kefir has become a much sold after food with a rapidly growing global market now available in its purest, most organic form in Uganda exclusively with Maziwa Dawa. Testimonies flood our inboxes of how a Maziwa Dawa milk has changed lives. Order yours today and enjoy the nice, smooth, cool 